Hello everyone, Spongester here, and I'm here to make a video about Cartoon Network celebrating their 30th anniversary. And this is going to be a quick video because I said a lot of what I have to say here in my HBO Max video. If you haven't seen that, go check that out. But it still astonishes me how much people just love to trash on Cartoon Network. To the point where they completely overlook the fact that this is a company celebrating a milestone that they don't really have to celebrate just to complain about the fact that they're airing Teen Titans Go on their 30th anniversary. It's just three airings of Teen Titans Go. I think you'll be fine. Are people really saying that they could have done more with this celebration? Do we really have to remind people of how they celebrated their 25th anniversary? Just one video on YouTube and that was it? They didn't play any classics on that day. And this time they're airing Airing classics like Billy and Mandy and Courage the Cowardly Dog, Ed, Ed, and Nettie, and people still feel the need to complain about it? The very moment that Cartoon Network announced that they were going to be celebrating their 30th anniversary, I just knew, I just had this feeling that a lot of people were going to have their expectations super high. Way too high, in fact. Especially after how they celebrated the 25th anniversary. I don't ever expect companies and corporations to go above and beyond. When the NFL tricked Spongebob fans into thinking that they were going to play Sweet Victory, personally, even before the Super Bowl even happened, I was skeptical. Because I just don't expect anything out of big corporations who can pull the plug at any second, which they did. So for Cartoon Network to do something that they don't really have to do by airing all of these classic shows, who cares if they air Teen Titans Go for like an hour? Who cares if they're not airing shows like The Moxie Show? I'm satisfied at the fact that they're celebrating at all. I've seen the Cartoon Network Twitter account reply to multiple Cartoon Network fan accounts, which is, again, something that they don't have to do. But they did. I genuinely believe that they did their best. The only thing that I'm worried about is the aftermath of all of this. After October 1st, what is the schedule going to look like? Just the same four shows over and over again, just like how it was before? Because if so, that's going to be very disappointing. So that's probably the only thing that I'm going to have an issue with. I would want them to continue airing their classic shows, and the shows in question don't don't even have to be that old. They can be shows like Adventure Time and Regular Show, and honestly, I wouldn't complain. Sure, I know that a lot of other people would complain, but, you know, it's the internet. So hopefully they continue to do that at least. All in all, people, please, just be happy that they're celebrating at all. They're literally doing a live stream on YouTube right now, where they're playing their old bum including bumps from the city era and I've seen so many people talk about the city era as if it's actually the second coming of Christ so be happy that they're doing all of this people really expect companies to be perfect who cares about the moxie show who cares about Mike Lou and Og if they're airing classics if they're sharing old bumps then what they're doing is a hundred percent fine but yeah that's all I have to say about this. Let Cartoon Network celebrate in peace. I'm a Spongester and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.